When it was first reported to the police, the amount believed which was obtained was about $40 million. Ultimately, we reached $300 million and pretty well stopped. John asked me could I fly him and several other people around to various places in southern New South Wales and Victoria. He didn't want to land anywhere, he just wanted to fly over these particular places that he gave me and circle them so that the people could look on the ground. The purpose of the day was to show the bankers these containers where they had all the equipment that they funded. So they were happy, they checked their asset. John was happy because the bankers didn't want to land anywhere and actually have a look inside the containers. And I'd just been out for days flying, so I guess I was happy. And these containers were either empty or they were fuel dumps. None of them had any equipment in them. When we used to walk to court up Russell Street, uh, people who recognised him would cheer and say, good on you, John. I feel he was used as a scapegoat. I, couldn't, I don't know the reasons why, but at the time, there was a lot of hidden bits and pieces.